Hey guys, what's going on and welcome or welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be doing a lip swatch and a review of the Inside Cosmetics Glide On Lip Liners. Now they have come out with 12 shades. I have all the 12 shades with me and for foundation shade reference, I'm NC40 in MAC and in Maybelline, I'm 310 Sun Beige. Now, if you have not already, then do not forget to subscribe button and the bell icon right next to notified whenever I upload. And now let's jump right in the video. So first, let's quickly go over with the features of these lip liners. Now, it says that it is long lasting, it is ultra smooth texture, glides easily and matte finish, lines and coats lips with weightless color for all day comfortable wear, free from parabens, sulfates, SLS, petroleum, phthalates, benzene, camphor, toluene and animal derivatives. Like I mentioned before, they offer a total of 12 shades and these are priced at 70 rupees for 0.3 grams of product. So this is how the packaging looks like, which is color coordinated with gold writing. At the bottom you have is the shade name and number. And since these are retractable, this is how the actual product looks like. And now let's finally move on to the lip swatches. <laughs>
All right, so let's go over with the formula, the pros and the cons. Now, firstly, these are very creamy and soft and these are quite pigmented as well, which makes it really easy to apply as a liner or even all over your lips like how I have done right now. Now, these are not drying even if you apply it all over your lips. It is quite moisturizing and it is not too creamy as well. It's just the right amount of creaminess. And also when you do press your lips together, it does not become grainy or powdery or patchy or anything of that sort, which I really do like. Now, transfer proof wise when you initially do apply them it does transfer a little bit however after a while it does dry down and it does become less like for example like there is a bit of a transfer but then it's not that much however the color payoff is still as it is on my lips now for the longevity of these lip liners if it is applied all over my lips like it lasted on me for like about four to five hours and then it slowly started fading a little bit and once i had a very heavy meal this is how it looks like and as you guys can see the outer line is remaining and if i do press my lips together it does give a decent color payoff like how i initially applied it now if you have subscribed to me for a while you guys will know i love anything retractable maybe kajals or lip crayons or even lip liners and these are I do love them especially because these are retractables and lastly for the removal of these lip liners it came off pretty easily by just using a wet wipe and now for the FII there are three points the first point is that there is no smell on these lip liners which is great the second point is that since it is retractable the quantity of the product is pretty low for example this one is about like 0.3 grams of product wherein any other pencil type of a lip liner that you would see it will be more than one gram of product personally Personally, for me, it's not an issue, but yeah, FII. And lastly, for the cons, there are two points. The first point, as per usual, there are no proper arm swatches available online, which could help like a consumer to pick and choose the right shade. So yeah, that is the first con for me. The second con is something from being super nitpicky about it, and that is to do with the shades that they offer. Now, the shades that they already offer are nice. There are 12 beautiful shades. However, if you fall under dusky or darker skin tone, there are not that many shades. For example, there is no dark brown shade. Like they do have a very nice selection of brown shades, but that will suit if you have like fair or medium skin tone. However, if you're dusky or darker, there are only very few hand-picked shades that will suit out of these 12 current shades that they offer. So overall, in my personal opinion, I do love and highly recommend these lip liners because firstly, these are retractable. Second, these are very affordable because it's very rare to see like a retractable type of a lip liner which is very affordable price wise and then is the formula which is extremely comfortable even to apply it all over your lips like how i have i have mixed like two shades by the way and it's still very comfortable on the lips and then is the shades like they are beautiful but it could be way better so yeah these were my thoughts on the inside cosmetics glide on lip liners and this finally wraps up today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it and if you did then do not forget to subscribe button and the bell icon right next to and find whenever i upload as well as like the video and comment down below if you have any questions or request i will try and answer for you as well as follow me on my socials which are on instagram and on twitter as well so until next time take care bye